What is up guys? This is uh, part three of the Moped Cafe Racer build. So today we're going to be upgrading the turn signals and as well as the light bulb in the headlight from an incandescent to a halogen light bulb. That's the old turn signal. This is the new one. So much better. And it's going to be smaller. So it's going to look really nice on this. So I'm going to go ahead and get the headlight off. And to do that, it just has two screws on each side. And it comes off and I unplug all the wires. And I'll get back to you. Alright, so once that's off, you're going to want to unplug the turn signals. And just quick connectors. And on these turn signals, these are the new connectors, but they won't go together. So what I'm going to do is just cut the wire here and then through this hole, I'm going to put it in there and somehow tape it. I know it's not the best, but I will change the connectors someday, solder in new ones, or in fact, just get new ones that crimp on like that. And I'll go back to you once I do that. All right, one thing you're gonna need to do is unscrew this nut right here. And then once that is done, you could pull it out and somehow manage it through these holes, through that hole. And then once you get that, you can pull this right off, slide the new one in, slide the nut onto the cables, and then you can put it onto this if you have connectors put them on and that should be pretty much it for turn signals and I'll be back when I have them mounted alright guys so I got them installed and man they're looking so much better so all I did was just took some electrical tape wrapped the wire around and should be good if anything I'll just buy a pack of the special crimp connectors Yeah, so it's looking good. Next, I'm going to show you how to update your light bulb with a good halogen light bulb or just how to change a light bulb in general. Here you go. This is a halogen one instead of a standard incandescent. And this is going to be 10 times brighter. And you can actually see at night when you ride around. So I'll get you set up and I'll be back. All right, so here's the headlight and take it apart. There's two screws, one right there and one right there. If you unscrew those, this top part comes off and the bottom and you'll just be left with the glass and a reflector with all the connections in the back. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'll be back. All right, so once you got them out, you just lift it and this is what you were left with so what you got to do is kind of pry it up a little bit like that and lift it but the thing is the bulb is way too wide for those little metal tabs so you gotta pull the clip out and then there you go so just push down and twist to the left and the ball pops out. Now on Thomas mopeds the high the low beam always burns out for no reason. And I'm guessing it's just high voltage, but the bulb may look fine. It does look fine, but it just doesn't work. Except for the high beam. So Here's the new bulb. And it's a halogen bulb, so it's much smaller. And you just do the same assembly as the reassembly. And over here you can see there's a small square and a, a big square and a small square. You match it up, push down. 
and then move it to the right. And there you go. Now because this is a halogen, make sure to wipe this with alcohol so you don't get premature death. And then just put it back in, put the clip in, put this in, screws, and then you're done with your headlight. guys that's the end of the cafe racer build for now there probably will be more parts and yeah so that's it and as always you guys have a great day